because I came a long way to see to it that it does not. And I brought one million light ships with me and I do not care about killing all y'all asses to make sure that that does not happen. And I'm not trying to be a smart ass. I'm just trying to be as informative as necessary. If someone was gonna kill you and they told you if you don't straighten up, they were gonna do that and they had the power to make this shit like this happen to you, then you should understand how privileged and blessed you are that I take my time out to make these videos even though you haven't responded righteously to any of them yet. But that's okay because see, when this water come and get your ass, you're gonna respond to the water with the way that's necessary to respond to it. So either way, your proper response will be demonstrated. You will bow down. Please believe that. Because I got too much stuff to be defeated. And like I said, if I die, you still got to deal with the sun that's creating all these circumstances that you're looking at right now. That are very serious circumstances that your Jesus ain't going to be able to do shit with or he rid of by now. And I'm not saying that to be more I'm just me. I just want you to know that that foolishness has to get off the earth. And that's why the earth is creating these weather formations to make it all go away. Destroying the infrastructure of the Zionist controlling that gave you the stupid ass religions and made you all dissect yourself and dichotomize yourself from each other. <clears throat> she said, Nassar, I need you to come to Mexico because I really, really admire you. I think that you are so debonair and I think that you could be a really, really good asset to me and I know that talking to you would be a good thing. So I'm going out of my way to express the genuine concern of my heart, all my passion to let you know that you are invited to partake of my delights because I like you, Asar, because you are Asar. So please don't keep me waiting. Get here any way necessary so you can soothe my burning inferno. After all, you said you like fires, so prove that by coming to find out about mine. I'll be waiting. I love you. Okay, now listen, see these holes right here? These things are another method of getting your asses out of here. Okay, you can see it just popped up right in the middle of the damn city. I mean, there was houses and everything right there where the hole is now. And look at this building right here. On this way in there. <laughs> see, the universe knows how to play with you. It's very colorful, if you will. So all of these occurrences is not just because they are flukes. This is your universe trying to talk to you and let you know that it's time off for this religious stagnant shit, okay? All this murdering and killing and suffering and stealth and deprivation and idiocy that you're all going to pay for. All of us, we're going to pay for it. We're going to pay for it, okay? So we better all get involved with one another and start learning how to love each other and fix this planet. That's the only thing that should be on your mind, to make the planet relax and get over her anger with us. And she's going to do that by watching you guys comply with buying the green light because they're going to watch the green light sales and they're going to make a determination if consciousness is changing by how much green light you guys buy. Because when you buy the green light and leave with it and then your neighbor have one and her neighbor have one and everybody have them in their pocket, the green light can fly over an area and say this whole area has the green light. I don't have to do anything here because that consciousness is changing. That's what it's all about. I don't need your money. I am so damn wealthy. You have no clue. It's just like the star has been saying. The God puts a quote on his back. Look at this. He shot the light right where it should have been. Right here, look. That's what our female should have been. See? Right there. Do you understand? That spaceship came here looking for his woman. You see the dick came down there to have that relationship with her. And she's gone. This is how I came to the earth. Like this. On the green light. My lights be green. And you can see this phallus came to the earth looking for that woman that was on top. <coughs> right there. 
and you Europeans stole it. The Spanish conquistadors stole it. So this guy that came down here in the night to impregnate the earth with the union that, we, that it would have had, with the gold that was here, had it still been there, they stole it. So this is how they're interfering with our extraterrestrial cosmic way our universe works. We are the extraterrestrials. All you Spanish people and all you melanated people on the planet had the knowledge to build this structure and lead our gold up there. So when this UFO showed up and shot that beam of light down there, that was supposed to be a sexual encounter that happened right here. But you people jacked the gold and the universe knows what a threat and how de detrimental you guys are. Because this is the proof. It said, where is the ship? And they already know it's all up in Europe, in you guys' museums. So it should be here, having a union with this light, and it's in your freaking museum somewhere. Imagine that. But then we gotta be the niggers and the thieves and everything, right? And you guys come into our lands and they, you tell them I'm sorry. They took that shit and they need to bring it back. If I could get my hands on those buckets, I tell you what I would do. I would stick something hot, red hot, right up their ass, and I'll pull it out through their mouths because I know oh, it should be right here. It should be there. And you know who took it? The Spanish freaking conquistadors. The same people who told my sister that her name was Maria Gonzalez. That is not her name. Okay. Peace and blessings, us all. We'll see you in your next video. Peace out. So yeah, I may I don't tell. I just want to give you guys real understanding of what's causing these things, being the universal forces that I brought to the earth with me. See, we don't destroy things. We recreate things. And that's the reason why we're using the weather formation to eradicate the undesirables off the planet, because that's not war. That is just you having an encounter with yourself. You don't understand yourself to be the elements, but that is exactly what you are. You are the water, you are the soil, you are the sun, <coughs> you are the air. So these methods of your eradication is not hostile. It is natural. It is nature. It happens all the time. It has nothing to do with someone killing you with a projectile or stabbing you or striking you or bludgeoning you to death. It happens to do with the fact that you need to be recreated because you are no longer allowed to be here. And we use the weather, on the weather, because you might not believe yourself to be weather, but that is exactly what you are, whether you know it to be so or not. So what's going on is that you are all having an encounter with yourself because it is necessary for you to have these experiences to return to your God self and eradicate your belief in a foolish God outside of self. Feel me? You see what someone said right there? What did it say? The wrath of God. Isn't that what it says? Okay, remember what I told you guys I'm going to do the tornado alley this year? Let's go ahead and give you a good example of what I've been doing already. I'm not liking this. Someone's got to do it. You guys are very wicked. This stuff is going to stop. The wrath of God. That's what it says there, because that's exactly what it is. Comply or die. It was simple. He said, I'm going to comply.
It's so sad you guys gotta keep going through this stuff because you won't learn and wake up. Us melanated people never ever had to suffer this much earth disaster coming to our neighborhoods and doing this stuff because we had our vibrations right. So this stuff never came up on us and did this to us. Because they communicate with you. Because they are you. You just don't know that. There's the spiral I tell you guys about. See, now we ain't no joke. Look at the, the damage. And see, the universe has been doing this stuff to you guys ever since you came over here murdering and killing people. You're just not smart enough to know that's what's going on. Tornado out. Come and get you. Oh, okay. There you go. Let you know who's doing it all. Send it to Mark. She said, please don't blow my little panties off. And God was nice. He let me survive, but I'm here to tell the story. We got to be nice to black people. This was gonna happen. It blew my panties off. Man, you Jesus. Man, you Jesus. We gotta be nice to black people and white people too. We gotta stop all our bullshit. We gotta start exerting love and really living up to it. Our Creed is supposed to be my religion. The very us loving, consumed, it's lying, it's that we be. And at the same time, we're murdering and lynching people and spitting all this shit. We want God said we good. But what's our God? Don't like that. He has all this power. She has all this power. What's our God? is a woman in him. Our God is just a man. The Tsar God has a woman, a man, and a little boy. The Tsar God says that they're all gods because they all come from it. And it's all created in the heavens. That's the spiral that approved it. I'm the cosmos, where I tell you guys I come from. So you do understand that I came from the future because you guys used all those nuclear weapons and destroyed the earth. So we set you up. We let you do it so we can have a strong case against you guys and show everyone that was spectators what you guys are capable of doing. You guys fucked up real bad. You murdered everyone and destroyed the whole damn planet. So go ahead and walk around with your superiority, consideration of yourself and all that shit, but just no defense at it. You're just fooling yourselves. You guys are terrible. You murdered everything on Earth and destroyed the Earth and caused radiation fallout all throughout the universe. And we've already turned off World War III. So those Zionists know it. They're just making you guys dumb as hell now because your help is here and you're rejecting it. But see, your help can also be your executioner. I want you to know that. Look, we'll 